Hello, and welcome to this introduction to 2D turning using Fusion 360. In this tutorial, you will learn how to machine this axle stub part. The purpose of these lessons is to give you quick answers to common questions. We'll be walking you through the complete process, showing you the series of steps required to machine this part from beginning to end using Fusion 360. This part is one of the standard samples available with Fusion 360. So we need to open that file. To open files, we will access the data panel. The icon for the data panel is shown in the upper left corner. Opening the data panel gives you access to your projects, files, and folders. For this project, we're going to open a standard file located in the CAM samples folder in a subfolder called Tutorials. If we scroll to the bottom, you'll find a sample part called Tutorial 6. Double click to open that part. Whenever you open one of the sample files, you'll notice it opens in read-only mode. So once the sample file is loaded, we'll want to save it into a project folder. Let's back up to the root folder by clicking on the arrow shown next to CAM samples in the upper left corner. At this point, you can save it to one of your existing folders, or you can create a new project folder. I already have a folder here called Mike's First Projects. I'll double click to open that folder, and I'll go to my pull down for files where I can select Save As. I'm going to use the same name, but give it a dash and my initials, and we'll hit Save. Once we've saved the file, we no longer need to leave the data panel open. I'll press the icon to hide the data panel, and that gives us more graphics area on our screen to work with. So that is the data panel, opening files, and saving files. 